The first foals by Champion Essential Quality have arrived, so we stopped by John Bell Farm to visit the four type grade one winner and meet one of his first foals. So Essential Quality, we're really excited to see his first foals being born. He bred a tremendous first book. Um, I think nine grade one winners and 10 dams of grade one winners. Um, so we have some really fancy mares that are pulling their essential qualities right now. Um, and overall, he's getting just tons of leg. I mean, a lot of hip. We've had two breeders so far have called to book their mare back to him. Um, so that is a huge indicator and positive sign that people are really liking what they're seeing. We have a very exciting essential quality colt had to spin the bottle. Very, very strong colt. A lot of weight when he was born, 150 pounds, really strong, a lot of bone. The best thing I really like about him is he has a two-term pedigree with a sprinter body. And that always gets my attention. He just, he blew me away when I saw him. I was like, wow, we should have bred more mares to him. He's the kind of horse that, um, you know, everybody who comes to see him always kind of goes, wow, like he's, he's really pretty. He's got a gorgeous shoulder. He's really well balanced um, and he is very correct, um, nice walker. Um, he has a, a great presence about him. From day one, he was a horse that was extremely special. Um, Brad Cox very early on kind of identified him as a horse who looked like a Belmont Stakes winner. And he was a horse that um, he did very rare things on the racetrack. I mean, he's one of only seven horses in the history of the Eclipse Awards to have been named champion two-year-old and champion three-year-old. You know, he never missed an intended workout. He never missed an intended um, race. And these are the kind of things that just, you know, it doesn't happen at that level. He also retired completely sound, um, race medication free, never trained on Lasix. Um, so he's a horse that we're confident his progeny will be extremely sound, and I think we have a lot to look forward to for that reason as well. One of the best things about Essential Quality is his female pedigree. He has a great race record, but his, his female pedigree is enormous, and that was why one of the reasons why we were drawn to breed to him and buy mares and fold to him as well. The reason I think Essential Quality is really good value in year two is, first of all, when you look at his body of work, um, he is still one of the best stallion prospects out there right now. Um, yes, he's second year, but when you're coming behind the kind of mares he bred in his first year, he you know, had these remarkable grade one winners and grade one producers in his first book. And you also look at the fact that he was a champion two-year-old um, who was three for three at two. You have to look at it like you'll be selling a yearling maybe in September after his first two-year-olds have started running um, at the big summer races at Churchill and at Saratoga, um, hopefully pointing for championship races in the fall. So I think he's great value in year two. And we're excited because a lot of breeders that, um, are coming back to him in year two. Um, so we think he's great value.